Could this be the raddest shrimp fly I've done on this channel? I don't know. Let's find out. Alright my dudes, so today we're going to be talking about a super rad shrimp fly that I've been tweaking for a little while now and ever since I started fly tying I've always been fascinated with the Borski slider and in some type of weird way I always, I always tied them, I always kind of fished them, I always just thought they looked like a redfish fly. To me in my mind I was like that is a redfish fly. Um, and then now I've been sort of working on this little fly that mimics some of that type of technique, at least with the head and different things and screw it. You'll find out. Check this out. Super rad shrimp fly. Here we go. Alright, so there you go guys. Obviously you can see how fishy this fly really is and I know it'll catch a ton of fish for you. If you fish redfish a lot on the flats, mangroves, all over the place, this fly is going to work. Obviously, different color patterns. Olive would work super well. Black and purple, all pink, orange and brown. These are all classic combinations for redfish that are going to catch fish. Chartreuse, don't forget that and all white i mean i don't see why you couldn't do this all white with some black legs and maybe some gray barring and you strip it like a bait fish fly too 
Um, just so many possibilities with this fly for catching fish in shore salt water, salt, any shore salt water. <sighs> you know what I mean? So check it out. Smash the subscribe button to this YouTube channel. Follow me on Patreon if you haven't. Simple Patreon slash backwater fly fishing and support this channel as well as get exclusive content to a bunch of other rad fly tying information. I'll catch you guys later. Deuces.